Greetings folks, uh, Celtic Cowboy here with you from Arderwood Farm. Uh, today the family project is uh, spinning honey. So we're going down to the field and go to the apiary and pull off all of the honey for this year from the bees. And we'll show you the process that we go through. Okay, gonna cover off a little smoke owl face. We put the bee escape already on this. So down on the bottom board, we have a one way escape. So as the bees come down, they can't get back up. We did that three days ago. So to try to get rid of most of the bees out of the hive. Each of these weigh about between, you know, 60 and 75 pounds full of honey. Go ahead, Al. Okay, smoke them up top. Coming with another 80 pounds of honey. Girls did well. Okay, so this is what the frames of honey look like. This is the capping on the top of them. They filled it all up. You can see a little bit right here where they haven't quite kept it yet. This is perfect and it's ready for the spinner. And put the uh, inner cover back on and put them together. Okay, so this is the last part before they go into the honey house. The most important thing is making sure you have absolutely no bees. So we transfer the bees one frame at a time into a new box before we roll everything inside. Because once we go inside, all the bee suits come off and nobody needs to get uh, stung. That's it. Okay, this is the next step in the process. So you see here a full complete frame that's totally capped and looking absolutely beautiful. It goes on the uncapping tank here and this is an uncapping knife so it's just uh, heated with electricity so you put your knife down on here and you slowly peel the capping off the top of the comb like this and see all, all just raveling off okay and one more go here on the near side and that's for your frame will look like when it's ready for the spinner on both sides. So these are what the frames look like when they're coming out of the uncapping machine. And then they go into the spinner here. This is a small spinner. You can get spinners of all sizes and you can also get them uh, in electric. So we uh, will just have this small one here. Uh, it takes us two or three hours to spin the honey out. Uh, it's better if you have the spinner like this, if it's a small one and you're going by hand, to have it on a platform that you can stand on because the spinner tends to jump all over the floor when it first starts. So you just spin away and then it comes out the front. Bye -bye. Okay, and here comes the beautiful nectar. Fantastic, beautiful honey. Thank you, bees. Good. Last part of the process. Filling up the jars. Well, that's a wrap at Arterwood Farm today, folks. That's all of our honey spinning done. Big shout out to the family for all of the help. It makes the day go much easier. All you gotta do now is contact us at Arterwood Farm and get your own farm fresh honey.